I'm holding in my hand a limb from a sugar maple tree that has a really bad case of what's called anthracnose. And anthracnose is a type of disease that occurs just on the leaves. Now, as with most of our disease problems, the time to spray for that is in the springtime when the leaves are very young and tender and the climatic conditions are correct, uh, i.e. very wet and cool for extended periods of time for those infections to occur. Another example of this is what's called black tar spot on Norway maple trees. The infection occurs very early in the springtime and that's the time when you want to treat it. Increasing light penetration to the tree would be helpful as well as increasing air circulation around the tree. If you want to treat it at this point in its life stage, it's not going to be effective because the infection's already occurred. A lot of times we go out to a property to look at trees where the client thinks that there's a disease growing on the trunk of the tree. A lot of times what we find is actually there's either moss or lichens that are growing on the tree. Now these plants are not harmful to the tree at all. They merely grow on the trunk of the tree. What it does mean is that you probably have a very shady environment in that location or a very humid environment in that location. In either case, these plants growing on the tree do not hurt the tree at all and nothing needs to be done for that.